Hi, my name is Diane Hoffman, and I'm starting over. Um, I'm also losing my voice, I think. Hi. Um, been a few days. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a delinquent. I'm a bad kid. Um, but I'm here tonight, and I just wanted to stop by real quick. Boy, my bookshelf looks really messy <laughs> in the lighting. It's not as messy as it looks. It's really not. Well, maybe it is. Okay, maybe I'll fix up my bookshelf. Um, <clears throat> but then again, I look like death now anyway. Um, I am working a launch this week, and I am working my tushy off, my voice off, my fingers off. Um, and I'm going to wrap it up, and I'm only going to stay here for a couple of minutes. And I know the light was terrible. I'm sorry. But um, I just wanted to talk to you about you all, my it's really terrible, um, and giving your all, and, and it's okay, uh, it's really terrible, uh, when it's time that you have to lay down, it's okay when you have to take a break, it's okay when, um, you know, life happens, although I've been talking a lot about how I survived, you know, my business through life happening, but then there are other times where you just really got to give it your all, whether you're getting something off the ground, you know, starting up your business or whether your business isn't where you want it to be. And you've drawn a line in the sand and you've decided it's time to go, 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 or whether it's something like this, a launch, um, that my, the company that I work with that I'm the top affiliate with has a annual launch where they put together this like bonanza, this big bundle full of cool stuff and software and all kinds of stuff. And it's an opportunity to make a, a really good chunk of change. Uh, that's worse. It's all bad. It doesn't, oh, wait, maybe, maybe you've seen my face. Um, so I would be foolish if I didn't run while the getting is good. And there's always windows like this, whatever your business is, you know, whether it's you sell weight loss and there's that January rush or the fall rush, or whether you sell financial services and everybody in January wants to clean things up in September is a big time or, you know, it really depends on what you sell, but there's always a window where people are buying anyway. Um, or when you take advantage of an offer, like I sell this membership, this, this software and, and, and training and stuff every single day. But right now there's just a window that makes it like a ton more attractive. So for me to get out there and really work for a couple of weeks can mean a large chunk of change that can be an insurance policy for a rainy day, or it can be an investment, or it can be um, like me, I'm trying to recoup, um, like retirement income, because during my divorce, um, you know, part of the, the terms were, whatever, it's a long story. I don't have a lot set aside for retirement. You're not supposed to say that, Diane. You're not supposed to, you're supposed to be a big guru. You're supposed to be this. Look, I've made plenty of money over years and I've done really well, but that's what happened. It was a choice of, you know, alimony that I was going to have to pay or letting some of the assets go. So I chose that. I chose to bet on myself that I could make up time. Um, and then I kind of laid down for, for years. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm turning 55 in a month and a half month, whatever it is. So I got, you know, I don't have a ton of time to, to catch up on that ground. And I'm revealing that kind of, I guess I revealed it on somebody's posts today. And so I'm just revealing it, you know, I, I, I need to, to catch up. And so that means that while I may work and earn really wonderful income, that means that a lot of a, a large chunk of it needs to be set aside, which means I have to really think about, uh, you know, my expenses and stuff like that. I haven't had to think about my expenses in years. So thinking about that and we're deciding it's time to make a lot more money, which is another option too. You know, it's another option. Um, a lot of times people think like, how do I cut back? And I'm like, how do I expand the income? I, I just think that way. So anyway, that's what's going on. I just want to let you know that tonight is a night. I used to make the videos in the morning and I'm sure I will again. Um, tonight is a night where I am absolutely tuckered out, done, 
I worked my face off today. And for that, I am thankful. So uh, I'll see you next time. Of course, leave me a comment, uh, you know, like, subscribe, hit me up, uh, message me if there's something I can do for you. If you want to know about the launch or the products or how to create your own info products or software or site builders or anything that I can help you with, always, um, you know, hit me up. But that's not what this series is about. This series isn't about marketing or selling. This series is about the trials and tribulations, the challenges, getting past them, getting past the emotional moments, getting past the anger. Um, everybody has anger, you know. Um, I've been doing, you know, I do so much work on myself in meditation and hypnosis and all this stuff. But it's still, it's still, you know, kind of bubbles up. Um, I'm a human, and so are you. Give yourself a break. You're a good kid. You're a good kid. I know you are. You wouldn't be watching this if you weren't a good kid. Except for you weird YouTube people that leave nasty comments on things. That, that you, you ever notice that the people that leave nasty comments all over YouTube, they don't have any video. They don't have a channel. They don't have any videos. They just have an account and they wander around and say nasty things to people. Ooh, I'm supposed to do that. A nice lady. Um, on a side note, I heard from my younger daughter today and she just planned her first big like adult vacation i'm very excited for her and looks like we're going to get together for my birthday which makes me really happy so i am now going to go sit on the couch and watch something i think marvelous miss maisel might have started back up and if it did i better be careful because if i watch one episode i'm going to want to watch them all i need to watch something that i'm happy with like one episode of any suggestions by the time I sit in for today, but you have a good night. I'll have a good night. We'll catch up. I'll clean my bookshelf and um, I'm starting over. See you later. Take care.